So hey Saints, it's Sister with a Testimony and I'm out here with Church Chat Granny, another Sister with a Testimony. We are at the Love's Travel Stop in Domino, Texas. We're out here blessing the truck drivers. We're having our fellowship service out here. And we just wanted to say hello, God bless you, good morning. We have a word, it's very short and simple. Uh, again, we're just out here blessing the truck drivers. We've had other people that are not truck drivers just come by and enjoy the service, enjoying the music, and just enjoying the worship. And God is here. He's at the loves. He's at wherever you're at, where two or three of us are gathered. Into the name of Yahushua Hamashiach, he said, I am in the midst of you. And we are a little flock, and we are bringing the blessings. So I just want to speak over you in the name of Yahushua Hamashiach that you have a wonderful, blessed day. We love you. We're praying for you. Y'all pray for us because we are in the field. We are the church without walls. We are demonstrating heaven on earth. I'm Sister with a Testimony, and I'm going to bring you Psalm chapter 5 today. And it seems to be the exact message that the truck drivers need to hear today, that you need to hear today, that we all need to hear today. Psalm chapter 5. Give ear unto my words, O Lord. Consider my meditation. Hearken unto the voice of my cry. My King and my God, for unto thee will I pray. My voice shalt thou hear in the morning, O Lord. In the morning will I direct my prayer unto thee, and I will look up. For you are not a God that has pleasure in wickedness, neither shall evil dwell with thee. The foolish shall not stand in thy sight. Thou hatest all workers of iniquity. Thou shalt destroy them that speak leasing. The Lord will abhor the bloody and deceitful man. But as for me, I will come into thy house in the multitude of thy mercy, and in thy fear will I worship toward thy holy temple. Lead me, O Lord, in thy righteousness because of mine enemies. Make thy way straight before my face. For there is no faithfulness in their mouth. Their inward part is very wickedness. Their throat is an open sepulcher. They flatter with their tongue. Destroy thou them, O God. Let them fall by their own counsels. Cast them out of the multitude of their transgressions. For they have rebelled against thee. But let all those that put their trust in thee rejoice. Let them ever shout for joy, because thou defendest them. Let them also that love thy name be joyful in thee. For thou, Lord, will bless the righteous with favor, wilt thou compass him as with a shield. Now, Father God, we just thank you and we praise you today for a supernatural hedge of protection. We ask you, Father, to go ahead of all of the drivers, all of the travelers, all of the people that are in their vehicles going up and down the road today, Lord, we ask you that you send supernatural protection around them. Send your angels, Father God, that they would know that you have gone ahead of them. You have made a crooked path straight, Father God, and that you are the Lord of Lords and the King of Kings. Your name is Jesus. You are God in the flesh. And Father God, we just ask you, have mercy. Have mercy on us, O oh Lord. Have mercy on this country. Have mercy, Father God. And we ask you, Lord, that you would send peace now. Father God, you are worthy of our praise. We thank you. We lift up the name of Jesus. And we ask you, Father, to have your way in every soul, every soul that is here today, every man, every woman, and every child. Father God, I ask you to go ahead of us, making that crooked path straight. And Father God, convict us. Instead of condemning us, Father, as only the enemy condemns us, but you convict us. Father God, you said that if my sheep that are called by my name, my people, if they are called by my name, they should humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways. And Father God, you said if we would humble ourselves before you and pray and seek your face, you will hear us from heaven and heal our land. Father God, I ask you to heal our land, starting with us, Father God, starting with our temple, Father God, for we are the temple of the Holy Spirit, Father God. We are to come to you and worship you in spirit and in truth. Father God, I ask that your Holy Spirit infiltrate the loves here in Domino, Texas. I ask you, Lord, that your spirit 
infiltrate every heart, mind, and soul and let us know, Lord, that you have our back. You have already blessed us with every spiritual blessing, Father God. I ask you to seriously, Lord, consider every truck driver, Father God. Lord, I ask you to protect them. Keep the cars out of their way. Keep the vehicles out of their paths. And Father God, I ask you to give them supernatural favor out on the highways and the byways. And Lord, I just ask that your spirit would fill every vehicle and every truck. And Father God, that your name would go forth, that your holiness would fill us, Father God, and that you would be so strong and your presence would be amongst us, Father God, in such a great measure, Lord, that it will cast out the darkness. There'll be no more darkness, for we have been called out of the darkness into the marvelous light. And Father God, you are the light. You said, I am the way, I am the truth, and I am the life, and no one comes unto the Father except by me. Father God, you are worthy of our praise. You are worthy to be honored. You are worthy to be glorified. Let everything that has breath praise you, the Lord. Father God, have your way today in Domino, Texas, at SWAT Dot Church, as we are saints and sinners and sons and sisters with a testimony. We are soldiers with a testimony, Father God. Let your word infiltrate the holy heaven above in the heavens, the holy earth beneath us to the north, south, east, and west. Father God, we ask that your spirit fall upon the dominoes, loves, truck stop, and you will have your way in every cab, in every car, in every truck. But Father God, most of all, in every heart. Father God, cause us to call out your name. You said all who call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Father God, we ask you to have mercy. Have mercy on us, Father God. Have mercy on our relationships and have mercy. Have mercy, Father God, in this country. And Father God, I lift up every ruler. I lift up every king, every potentate, every man and woman and civil authority, Father God, for there are none that have been placed in authority that you have not placed, Father God. And I ask you to humble the men and women that are rulers over us, that are civil authorities, and that they would make the example, that they would humble themselves, Father God, that we would have a mandate, not only to go ye therefore into all the world, but Father God, that the government would bow their knees. According to your word, every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ of Nazareth is Lord to the glory of God the Father. And Lord, I ask you that every blind eye be opened and every deaf ear be opened. And Father God, not only will they see with spiritual eyes, but they'll hear with those spiritual eyes. Not only will they hear with spiritual ears, but they will see and understand with those spiritual ears. Father God, you said in your word in John chapter 4, verse 24, them that worship me must worship me in spirit and in truth because I am a spirit. Father God, your word says you are spirit. Father God, give us the Holy Spirit in a greater measure that we would fear you. And Lord, I ask that the spirit of the fear of the Lord God Almighty fall in this place Binding every spirit of chaos, confusion, strife, and thriving, and be loosed, Father God, over this place, the spirit of the fear of the Lord, quenching all doubters, all mockers, all gainsayers, all witchcraft workers. And Father, I ask that your spirit, your spirit is welcome here. We love you, Lord. We praise you and we just lift up the name of Jesus. Saints, I plead and apply the blood of Jesus over you to hide, protect, and keep you. I plead and apply the blood of Jesus to every vehicle here, every man, woman, child, dog, cat, whatever can hear me. Let everything that has breath praise you, the Lord. I declare and decree that this is the day the Lord has made. We will rejoice. We will be glad in it. And Father God, we will praise you. Let the blood of Jesus hide us, protect us, and keep us. And Lord, whoever needs to hear this, 
Let them hear it even in their truck supernaturally, in their car supernaturally. Lord, you are the one that gives the increase. I praise you, Lord, and thank you. Saints, have a blessed day. We love you. God bless you. We're at the Love's Truck Stop every Sunday at 930. You're welcome to come and gather with the flock. In Jesus' name, is sisters with a testimony. Amen. Thank you.